the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. spirit. Dear brothers and sisters, we gather to bless this memorial garden of our parish. This is holy ground, for here people come to encounter God through prayer and silence. It is, in a true sense, an extension of the most sacred space of the church, where we are nourished by the sacraments. Here people come to reflect, pray, breathe, hope, and celebrate. Under the protection of our Blessed Mother, and through her intercession, may we be renewed in a deeper trust of God's presence in our lives especially when we feel abandoned or discouraged. The bricks that have been placed here are reminders to us of those we love who have gone home to God, of blessings we have received through this parish, those who have strengthened us along life's journey, and other memories of gratitude and love. May this space always be a respite from the world so that God's grace can be felt and deepened. Let us pray. Almighty and merciful God, in the beginning you chose to express your creativity and companionship by creating a garden. It was in a garden where your son offered his will perfectly to yours. In a garden, your son, risen from the dead in glory, appeared to Mary of Magdala, speaking her name and opening her eyes to the power of new life. In the end, when all of your desires are fulfilled, there will again be a garden. It is in this promise and grace that we bless and dedicate the use of the St. Gerard Magella Memorial Garden to the glory and use of you, the one true living God. May it be a quiet place for those who need rest. May it be a joyful place, delighting the senses. May it be a peaceful place, restoring hope and faith. May the flowers here remind us to keep blooming. May these branches and the benches here remind us to stop and pray. May the trees remind us to root ourselves in Christ and shelter one another in grace. In every season, may this garden welcome our neighbors and draw us all to the goodness of our Creator and Savior. We place all our trust in you, gracious Father, knowing that you are doing more for us than we could ever ask or imagine. Hear these our prayers, through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 Friends, the Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow down for the blessing. The Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And may Almighty God bless all of you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Special word of gratitude uh, really for all of you who are here. I know many of you have uh, asked for memorial bricks, and many others in our parish who could not be with us tonight have as well. I'm grateful to the members of our staff and volunteers who work uh, not just for this moment, but throughout the year to make this space um, beautiful. In fact, there'll be another enhancement in the next few days through the generosity of some uh, young men who are pursuing their Eagle Scout projects who have agreed to help beautify this area even more. And of course, people have been asking, you know, if I want another brick or if I didn't have a chance to get a brick this time, we'll be communicating to the parish very soon about the next batch, which we hope to install sometime in the early fall. So word will be out uh, via all the usual uh, methods, the bulletin, our website, um, and online as well. So we thank you very much for being here. We do hope that this is a, a respite for you and um, in time to fill up all of these spaces, which honestly not only helps the parish financially, but also secures a beautiful memorial for us here. 
I'm also grateful to Deacon Frank, who spearheaded this for me um, and helped to coordinate all of the uh, logistics. So I'm grateful to him and again to our staff and volunteers who helped in designing and also beautifying the space. So thanks all very much. I hope you enjoy the rest of the evening and have a great Independence Day. God bless you. Thank you.